Okay, this is James P. Madonna of the Facebook group. Everything is food. Um, it is Friday afternoon. It is buffet time. Lunch buffet. Here's the walk of fame. The walk of buffet fame. All right. Heading, heading towards Royal Hibachi Buffet. Route 46 West, Saddlebrook, New Jersey. Forget it. Cricket Wireless, they're a bunch of crooks. I hope, I hope Fatty Arbuckle is not here. I hope that this is not going to be a Fatty Arbuckle day with some kid leaving the, the damn freezer open. All right, making all the hard ice cream soft. All right, I hope this is not what's going to happen today. Royal Hibachi Buffet. Route 46 West, Satterbrook, New Jersey. Welcome to Royal Abachi. Hopefully there won't be no little baby Chris Christie's just hovering over the uh, ice cream freezer. The new hard serve, hard, uh, hard scooped ice cream, making it all soft, letting all the refrigeration out. Fatty Arbuckle. Hope he's not here, but he might be. And I enter. Here we go. Okay, round one. James P. Madonna here. All right, not bad, not bad. They got some good sushi out. All right. Is the, ah, look at the unagi, unagi, white uh, tuna. Oh, look at that regular tuna. Squid. And the old, the California roll style. Uh, you know, for the, for the people that are that are faint of heart, you know, that don't go for the hardcore. Let me see. Speaking of hardcore, let's see what we got here. Chicken franchise, eh, beef tenderloin, salmon. I don't know. You know what? I see, I see chicken, and I can see chicken anytime. Chicken franchise. All right, let me try it. Chicken franchise. juice that they used to polish the uh, loadable uh, mace balls from uh, Southern California you know the juice the juice oh, look at this I'm doing look at that how to use your head in today's world you gotta use logic look at that I made a little baby spoon from from the tongs from the tongs look at that there Commodore Jeff Zambello I guarantee look at that, look at that. So oh, by the way, the uh, your uh, favorite ladies say hello. They're sitting right next to me. I, I'll, maybe they'll let me put them on video and say and wave. Let's see what happens. What do we got here? Stuffed shells. Oh, fruit of the mar. Look at the, oh man. Look at this. 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 Look at this, look at this Commodore Jeff Zambello. I will have a very different surf and turf. Calamari, like a saute calamari with tentacles. Oh, with tentacles. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Oh, this is a, definitely a delight. King Neptune's, look at this. King Neptune's delight. Saute tentacles. Fruit de Damar. Oh, I got it. So, I'm so pleased. Look at this. Look at that. I'm so pleased. Now, this is a very unique surf and turf. Because right, we got that 
chicken franchise and we got sauteed calamari with tentacles. Oh, unbelievable. 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 What's going on? Here we go. Chicken franchise sauteed calamari with tentacles. Now we're gonna come over here. Oh Commodore Jeff Sambello, Salvatore Mercurio, look what I found. It's back. Butterfly fried Cameroons. King Kong Cameroons. Fried shrimp battered in coconut. I don't care what Yosemite Sam said on that cartoon when he said he hates coconuts. Uh, remember that? He said, I hate coconuts. This is good. Oh, this is great. This coconut batter. Yeah, coconut what? Coconut shrimp. Coconut shrimp. Yeah, they, I, excellent. I had it once before. Oh, King Neptune's delight. You know what? I, I don't care what certain people say. I, I, even though I eat to live, I also live to eat, and also I am well-rounded. And I have some, my closest friends are well-rounded people. I don't, know, I don't mean they're well-rounded like Chris Christie. You know, uh, Krispy Kreme, Crisco, Chris Christie. I don't, I don't mean they're obese. I mean they're well-rounded mentally, mentally. They got cheesecake going on over there. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, oh I don't have room, but look at the squash. Oh, look at the beautiful squash. I don't have any room. I have to come back for that squash. But that squash will definitely be squish wash once I start chewing on it. That's for damn sure. Um, I didn't even look at the duck, to be honest with you. Let me check it out. Hold on. Let me check it out. Let me see if the duck is out of luck. Oh, the duck is definitely out of luck. Look at that. Yeah, it's just scraps. We got to get a shot of the old craw daddies in honor of Jay Tirio of Southern Louisiana. Uh, guarantee the, the King Cajun um, fermented beverage uh, emperor of the universe. Yes, yes, we are having a show on my birthday, August first, uh, uh, all about Taylor Cream Sherry. I uh, guarantee. Okay, now I'm going back to my seat and I'm going to enjoy this King Neptune's delight here at the Royal Abachi Buffet. Okay, Jeff Sambello, the ladies would like to say hi. Hi. You remember these ladies, right? You, you better, otherwise you better take Omega-3 uh, fish oils if you don't remember them. There they are, saying hello. hello. Yeah. Oh, I don't want her turning her neck. Sending their regards. She's made out of rubber anyway. No, you, she's Sending their regards, whatever that means. All right, there they are, you got it? All right. Okay, this is round one. Royal Hibachi Grill, Route 46 West, Saddle Brook, New Jersey. Here are my lovely lemons. Very medicinal and refreshing. See how many lemons I took? They don't, they don't make money on me here. <laughs> anyway, here's it. I got coconut, butterfly coconut shrimp, uh, chicken franchise, and marinated squid. As you can see, with the tentacles, with the tentacles. Gotta love it. And some cherry tomatoes. And hopefully, hopefully that kid won't let all the refrigeration out of the, out of the hot ice cream like he did last week. Remember Commodore Jeff Zambello, the old fatty arbuckle. Well, there goes the fatty arbuckles. And there you go. One left and one arrived. A hot ice cream station. Alright, James Prima Donna here, round two. I got myself some 
yellow squash, one piece of zucchini, some grilled uh, cauliflower. Round two. Excellent, excellent. Now let's see what we got going. Let me go to my favorite section. I mean, next to the sushi, my favorite section. Uh, let's see what they put out here. Salmon, chicken franchise, flounder with shrimp in the middle. Huh. Now nah, I'm gonna go for the sushi. Oh yeah, I was supposed to get the crab soup. You know what? I'll get that separately. I'll get that separately. Uh, gotta get some unagi and um, um, white tuna, sashimi. Standard tuna. Standard tuna shot of sashimi. Standard. It's like standard and pours, you know, an investment. Um, Alright. Unagi roasted yolk. Getting too, but we got it. Guess I overdid it with the squash, huh? I'm gonna eat this plain with nothing on it. That's what I think I'm gonna do. About it, aside from the crab soup. Let's see, it's over here, I think. You told me about the crab soup. And there it is. Just make sure you stir it up and scoop it from the bottom. Otherwise, you'll get more liquid than anything else. Um, let's see. Let's see. Okay, they had a problem with the uh, multicolored uh, flashing LED lights before. That's something to do with uh, probably the kids, the fatty arbuckles that kept on swinging the door open. Uh, they have to really brace the wiring with electrical wire or gorilla tape. Okay, that's what's what's causing these uh, beautiful LED lights to keep on going out. Ice cream. Cream. Uh, hopefully, the fatty arm buckles will not make my hard ice cream get soft, but that's wishful thinking, right? Look at they put out some spinach pies. Isn't that lovely? Cooked in the phyllo dough. The phyllo. Or is it phyllo? Phyllo. Phyllo. I like, I don't know, I like phyllo. Has an erotic sound to it. Filo. I love it because they, if it's done right, they put feta cheese, I believe, inside. I think I took, I think I took too many veggies. I can always come back for more. Yeah, well, hope, hopefully the LED lights will not turn off. All right, I rest, I rest my case, as you can plainly see on video. Need I say more, right? Uh, so anyway, let me go back to my seat.
Arbuckle. Arbuckle. But at least, uh, at least she, at least she's shutting the door to the freezer. That, that's a real good thing. You know. So anyway, um, I have to go back to the crab soup to get more. Okay, the conclusion of round two. Uh, here's my lemons. I got uh, the Greek spinach pie. Um, well, the mini ones. I got some uh, sashimi, both regular tuna and white tuna. Sashimi, right? I have some unagi, which is roasted eel. Roasted uh, freshwater eel. Uh, and way too much squash. I don't know what made me do it. Not the cauliflower, but the grilled squash. I took too much. Oh well. Round two concluded. Next, I will get some of that nice crab soup that the owner and head chef recommended. And uh, so far, the hot ice cream station is looking good. I don't see any uh, fatty arbuckles uh, hanging over it. Keeping the door wide open, letting out all the refrigerant. I hope to God I end up with hot ice cream. Fatty Arbuckle, Fatty Arbuckle, 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 Huckle Buckle. Commodore Jeff Zambello, I make, I, I make a very good point. The problem, the really, the problem is, is not shutting the doors. It is, it's not so much the the weight, the girth. Uh, uh, the body mass index of the uh, humanoid, the homo sapien, it is the fact that they, they do not close the freezer doors. Now to all you hecklers and trolls that like to bust my balls about this subject, just use your brains and your ears and, and, and listen to and focus on what I am saying, which you really don't, because you're trying to get it under my skin because you simply have keyboard courage because if you if you if you got clobbered by my USDA grade A fist you will never get up again never get up again I guarantee you that I scream I scream I scream I hope to God that hard ice cream is still solid when uh, I decide to get mine. I scream. <laughs> this, this man is the king of all the whole restaurant the industry. The He's the king of the buffet. The king's on the buffet. And don't you ever forget it, either, yes, people. There you go. I hope it Oh boy. Okay. I hope that guy don't come to the ice cream station. There'll be nothing left. Okay, just relaxing here. I'm almost ready to get my congrejo soup, my hot crab soup, before I attempt to uh, go for the ice cream. Right. I'm almost ready to go. Ready now. Okay, round three Royal Hibachi 
Buffet, Route 46 West Saddlebrook, New Jersey. Let me get some, um, what would be a good color for the crab soup? I'll get this one. Crab soup. All right. Our buckle, fatty our buckle. I want to dedicate this lunch buffet to, to the mitochondria, the mitochondria, the minute cellular level of the muscle cells and, and the amino acids that they require, the protein grams, the amino acids they require. Yes, we live to eat, and I'm proud of it. Commodore Jeff Zambello and possibly uh, Salvatore Mercurio and myself, maybe even the creator Mario Petrus, we Maybe even Anthony Laura. We live to eat. Now, I'm giving you a lesson in, in soups and stews. Always stir the bottom and grab from the bottom so you don't get gypped. You don't get shafted out of the uh, delectable succulent ingredients. This is the uh, owner and head chef's uh, special crab soup. Fruit de Damar. Good for the testosterone, good for the gonads, the mitochondria. To the mitochondria. And to Commodore Jeff Sandler. All right, now. Oh, where they go? Oh, look at they, oh, look at they put out there. I'm gonna have, I might have to come back for some of this. Oh my God, they finally put out leg of lamb. Oh, look at that, leg of lamb, maybe? I don't know. Oh, maybe it's beef, oh, beef tenderloin? Oh, I'm sorry, my mistake, beef tenderloin. A little too well done for me. Oh, shit. But they did put out whiting. They got whiting fish, right? Whiting fish. Some more salmon filet. I don't know. Whiting's kind of like a like a like a peasant fish, you know. It's, it's a low class fish. It's like it's like a a real cheap ass low low class cod, but it, it's still it's still a creature from the sea, you know. I can't. I'm not gonna totally put it down. There's the crab soup, right? Those are my lemons. Here's the lemons. Uh. Uh. Our buckle. All right, there it is. No obstruction. No one in front of the eye screen. The beautiful ice cream hand scoop hard ice cream station. Hopefully, the ice cream is still hard with the lovely uh, flashing multicolored LED lights here at the Royal Hibachi Buffet, Route 46 West, Saddlebrook, New Jersey. This is James P. Madonna from the Facebook group that everything is food. Okay, last round. It's time for I time for the ice cream. Hopefully it'll be hard ice cream. But I think they turned on the lamps. I think they turned on the lamps. So look at that. They brought out the snow crabs. Uh he looks like maybe king crab. Here's the shrimp with the heads on. The shrimp and creole sauce, of course. Okay. Oh, look at that. They got the lamps on. Beautiful, beautiful. Beautiful. Look at that. Beautiful. All right.
Okay. Seems to be a party going on in there. Um, let's see. I thought this was lamb, leg of lamb, but it's not. There's a the gentleman uh, doing the Mongolian barbecue gr grill or griddle. Right. Someone, uh, someone selected specific items. Of course, you can custom make your own meal. And uh, there it is, sizzling. Put, put various sauces on it, depending on what you like. The Mongolian barbecue here at the Royal Abachi Buffet. It smells great, though. Garlic, onions. I can smell the garlic. Gotta love it. The only thing is, they don't have lamb, right? at least I don't think so. Mongolian barbecue, sizzling away. There we go. Oh, oh here comes another one. Oh my god, this guy's really busy. This guy, good thing he's got a tip bucket. It's like the Benihana of Tokyo. Chef of the Future from the Royal Abachi uh, Buffet, cutting up the meat. But then again, people have steak knives, they can cut their own. But this guy is nice enough to do it. All right. Da, 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 da. There we go, looks good. Beautiful. They do it, they really have a great service here, you know? They really do. I never seen this before. The uh, takeout container accommodating a Mongolian barbecue. <clears throat> and there we got he's getting ready, cleaning that gorilla. The gorilla grill. Scraping it off. And uh, there's Mount. There you go. He's getting ready for another one. And yeah, that's it. Sizzling away. No lamb, no, no chorizo, no nothing fancy. No, they say sometimes they have it, but right now they don't have it. Oh, okay. Oh, shit. Uh oh. Uh oh. I feel sorry for her, man. Yikes. Workout. Poor woman spilled all those dishes. Got it. Yeah. The boy is good to exercise. Work out, you know. Oh my God. 
Alright, okay. Yep, yeah, it's true. Okay, that's it. Grand finale for this week. Ice cream, right? And uh, it's only gonna be vanilla. Nothing fancy. It's going to be a vanilla week. And it is very hard. To my surprise, I am very happy that the ice cream is not soft. It is very solid, very hard. And uh, which means the freezer is working well and people are closing the door. And that's that. That winds it up. Have a good one, people. Have a safe weekend and week. It happens to be... Um, we're getting towards the end of July 2018 here. And uh, I'd like to uh, announce that I will be live on my birthday, August 1st, on Jay Tirio's, um show, um, which will be about Taylor, New York State Taylor, Cream Sherry. We have done um, shows on uh, Taylor Port. They're dessert wines. This time it's going to be Taylor Cream Cherry. And uh, sometimes he does uh, uh, whiskeys, bourbon, scotch, you know, whatever. Craft beer uh, also. But this time it is Taylor Cream Cherry on August the 1st, 2018. Um, don't forget to join his Facebook group called Alcohol Lakes. Jay Terrio. Okay, alcohol eggs. It's spelled T H T H E R I O T. Um, just look for alcohol eggs, and you will get a great education in fermented beverages of all kinds. Uh, take care. And remember, what Commodore Jeff Zambello says, we eat to live, but we all, but more importantly, we live to eat. And a true athlete, a true strength training athlete needs his proper grams of protein and amino acids for his mitochondria and his muscle cells to rebuild. And uh, Jeff explained to me there are certain individuals that are anti-food culture. And uh, those people uh, often eat in um, nationally advertised garbage franchise establishments where they pre-measure all of the food uh, that is served in these restaurants. And, and sometimes you have to actually, no, I take that back. Most of the time, you have to wait for a table for this garbage food. But we, um, Salvatore Mercurio, Anthony Laura, Mario Petrus, <clears throat> Mick Von Raven, myself, Jeff Zambello, we prefer high quality f food from uh, smaller, non corporate, family owned establishments, family-owned restaurants, okay? That is where you get the quality. You jabronis out there, you imbeciles, you knuckleheads. Ah, oh, the glimmering multicolored lights of LEDs by the hard ice cream station, the hard self-scooping ice cream station. How beautiful and hypnotic those LED lights are. And they're changing colors. Isn't that, isn't that nice? 